Hey, hi, hello, welcome back to Planning with Jamie. Today we are going to make our two page week at a glance spread. So you can see last week I threw it in, I haven't filled it in yet. Um, this is something on my to-do list for today, but I used the heck out of this, you guys. Look at this, like, love it, love it, love it. Here is the monthly, very busy. I need to fill in my April to-do list. I already have like it all written out. I just need to get it on there. But guys, look at this two page spread. Every now and then, yeah, I'm missing a week because it's generally that the week is too busy and I just don't stop. But I feel very frazzled when I do that. But look, it is like working so well. This is my March running to do list. I need to go through and there's a few things that I can get um, marked off of here that I already see. But I've tried a few different things with this, but generally, like this is all my work stuff and this is all my personal stuff and it works so, so well. Um, so this week we are going to do week 17. It's April 22nd through the 28th. Um, it's my anniversary, my wedding anniversary today, 19 years, you guys. Like, oh my gosh, it has flown by, but at the same time too, like... I don't know, it feels like yesterday, but it feels like 20 years ago, all at the same time. It was just wonderful. I love this man. I'm so happy I chose him and that he chose me. So week 17, April 22nd through the 28th, we are using kit 318, which is right here. Guys, this is gorgeous. Look at these colors. Does this scream spring to you? Like it has been so cold all weekend and we are just so super excited. I think by next weekend, we're supposed to start getting a little bit nicer weather. So this is the seven by nine week at a glance for kit 318 that we're going to use. So just this one page is all you need to make this two page spread. Um, so this is what we're using. And then it has the coordinating daily duo. This is the seven by nine. Everything's available in A5 also. So lo and behold, like choose your size there. Uh, so kit 318, we got a glance. We'll kind of throw it out here. Let's put that one down there. All right, so you've got all the parts that you need, your headers with your dates, you have your boxes, your seventh box with all your scripts and your checks off, check offs, your lines, and then you have your timed labels. So if you love coordinating like I do, I absolutely love coordinating kits. Um, you could choose both of them. All right, so we use a monthly planner. Um, I am considering for next year just using a notebook because right now I am decorating the calendar in this, but I don't need to. Like I can do that in my daily duo. So I'm considering just getting a notebook from Erin Condren and using that instead. And I think that it will still work out perfectly. I have not decided. I did not order with this last event. I'd consider doing it and in the end I just didn't need to um, and so it all ended up working out. Okay so I so said we are week 17 and we are April 22nd through the 28th so let's write that in. This year is just flying by, you guys. I cannot believe that is already like end of April. Just absolutely crazy. Okay, so let's think about what we have going on. I show this all the time. I have my little cheat calendar right over here. You can see this gets messy. I'm okay with messy here because I went clean here. So it works out to kind of pre-plan and stuff. So first and foremost right here, I think we need to write happy anniversary because that is something to be very, very proud of, you guys. That was supposed to be an S and it ended up, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> That's what happens when you like talk and do it at the same time. What I was looking to do is this. Well, I guess it, it turned out the same in the end. Okay, so happy anniversary. And like I said, 19 years. And we'll put a few hearts around it. Okay, and then a few other things. Monday is payday. This cut through at the bottom. I'm not quite sure why I ended up doing that. I'm gonna look at my settings. Um, it was a new blade, and so I don't know if that's a portion of it 
or exactly what ended up happening, but it happened and it's okay. All right, the other things, it is a trash and a recycling week. So we need that. I like putting them, let me grab. I like putting them over here at the edge. Makes it nice and easy. There we go. And then I work Tuesday and Wednesday. I think I'm going to put a box in front of work. I generally don't. Let me pull that for two seconds. I generally don't, but I'm also consistently not using all these boxes, so I might as well. All right, so if we're gonna put boxes in front of it, let's just go in order. On Monday today, we have um, some dance and we have soccer. So we have, oh, and we had a rock delivery. And I don't know if I have enough space for all of this um, because right in happy anniversary. Um, let's just put it right over here. So we got three tons of rock delivered. So let's put, this can be soccer, five to 6 p.m. And then rock delivery. So three tons of rock. Um, seems a little less than what I expected it to look like. But at the same time, um, we can order more if we need it. So rock delivery, we are expanding our garden and we have rock as the base layer for all of it. And then we have um, GDT dance. And this is tryouts, like it's official go time, you guys. 3.45 to five, this is very sloppy writing. I didn't know what's going on. Rock delivery already happened this morning. We can cross that out. All right, Tuesday we have four things. So we're just gonna slap this down. There we go, it's a little bit crooked. All right, so first thing first is I work. Um, and I work seven to three. Okay, then second, we need to drop off our truck. Um, okay, GMC drop off. Then third, third we have um, tryouts again. So it's a three day tryout, GDT dance. That's 3.45 to 5. So all three days, we need to pull our daughter early. And then we also need to pull her early on Thursday for an orthodontist appointment. And I'm sure her school thinks I'm like completely crazy at this point. And then Tuesdays is when we do the injection for my son. So I'm just going to write that so that it doesn't get missed by any means. Okay. And then let's go ahead grab another strip here. On Wednesday, I work. We have tryouts. We have early out. And I think that's all. So three. And it's trash and recycling day, but that's already there. So we are good for that. Okay, so work. This day, I work seven to seven. We have tryouts. And this is the official, official tryout day. And so um, it might go longer than five o'clock. She said she'll have to see. Okay, and then what was the last thing? Oh, early out, two o'clock early out. And that's just for my littles. Um, somewhere here I need to do a grocery order and pick up. I haven't decided that portion yet. I meant to put it in last night for me to pick up this morning and I messed up. And that might throw off the whole entire week because me working these two days. Okay, Thursday, we have a talent show. We have orthodontist. And we hear if um, our daughter makes it onto that dance team. So that's really exciting. We have dance like all these nights too. I'll see if I have room for that sticker. Okay, so let's go in order here. Um, 310 Lexi Orthodontist. Okay, 
Okay, and then we have six to eight talent show. And then find out if Lexi made GDT dance team. And I kind of like it. So normally they like always email parents everything, you know, and they actually said the kid needs an email. This is how we're communicating with them. And um, so it's kind of fun because um, like she gets to like open her own email and see it and stuff like we don't get to see ahead of time. A lot of times though, I never open stuff until I'm around them so that they do get the excitement and the experience. Um, up here too, for the dance tryouts, she has to wear black on this day. And then up here, she needs to take her physical, but I don't really have time or don't really have space to write that. Okay, so that's exciting. And then Friday, um, she has a two hour early out. Okay, and then Saturday we have a dance thing for my youngest. It's the end of the dance season and we just got like 15 emails. I'm exaggerating, but it was like five emails, literally one after another. Um, so five emails about like stuff we need to get done this week and for recital and tickets and make sure, you know, order your shirts and <laughs> just a whole bunch of stuff. Okay, so Saturday I said we have from 10 to 11, Kenzie Dance Comp Workshop. And this is the last one. I am so excited to hear like, what their placement is going to be for next year, but I'm kind of sad too because I love all their teams. I mean, there's been drama. Like, don't don't get me wrong here, but <laughs> I also just I love the the team bonding that they end up doing. All right, then we have Emma's seventh birthday party. I think it's from one to three, but I've got to double check that, so I'm not going to write in the time yet. All right, let's get our binder back out here. I can get rid of this now that I have stuff written down. And then this is so easy. It starts going fast after you fill a lot of this out. So we have the header up here and there is this top line. I just literally line it up with that and it fits perfectly. Then we have this beautiful weekly glance. Honestly, because this is so long, it works best to turn it sideways. And I used to line it up with the edge of the gray lines, and now I go further over because it just allows me more space to be able to write my to-do list because I have found <laughs> I have quite the to-do list, you guys. Okay, so we've got that portion of it. And then I think to be able to go against the color of this, I think I'm going to grab this teal one. And... Let's go up just a titch more. I don't need this perfectly centered. I don't really mind anything. And then last time I put priority to do up here and I kind of like that, like using both words. Okay, so that page is all done. And then if we flip it over, this is going to become my work page. And so this one, I grab a few extra stickers I have in my, um, in my store, but, um, Let's get the bottom box. So this is where I get my spacing all the time is this bottom box ends up going in this bottom corner and I end up using this. I go down further than the gray line also to allow me more writing space because I need it. Okay, so I end up putting that there and then grab one of the washi strip runs and I put it here at the very top and I just go over quite a bit. So generally, these two are going to end up lining up. This is a little crooked. I'm sure you guys can see that. Not the end of the world. But if you push a ruler against them, like it'll kind of get stuck on the edging. And so it makes it like so easy to do that line. Okay, so we've got that portion of it. And then up here, 
Last week I ended up doing this a little bit differently too because I knew I didn't work out. I'm disappointed in myself, I need to, but I knew I didn't and so I didn't even save this face for it. One, two, three, four, five. So these are meal ideas right here. Let's get our X-Acto knife here and just cut off the excess. I cut my thumbnail like it ended up breaking off really, really short. So now I have no nail there to end up pulling stickers up. And it's really, really frustrating. I am like that person that has longer nails all the time. Oh guys, I didn't even put my wedding ring on and it's my anniversary. <laughs> Better get that on before school gets out. I always have it on, but I was a little swollen last night. We um, grilled and we had some potato chips, so that didn't help. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, so seven days for the week, and this is gonna be my workout section. So yeah, usually I have longer nails and it makes like grabbing these stickers so easy. And then this is all my filming or my video section. Okay, let's cap this so that I don't get hurt. And then a few things that I use right here, I use my meals and my workouts. Let's put workouts and let's put meals. Okay, and then this is probably good for now. Like we're gonna move this out of the way. Oh, you wanna know what else I did this morning instead of getting straight to work? I had all these Planner Kate um, freebies that I've gotten with uh, grab bags that I, I love those grab bags, they're awesome. But anyways, look, I peeled all these off and I put them into my reusable sticker binder and so just wait this is this is so pretty um so I love this binder like look how helpful this is I know exactly where to go I have them all grouped into like categories and so when I need extra things I know where to go for them we're gonna be using all this for a minute yes I peeled all these individually off a sheet that was like a full sheet but I wanted to get rid of the sheet like consolidate myself all right here are freebies Freebies, freebies, I love this page. This page is really fun. Um, freebies and the last page of freebies. So instead of having all these tiny little ones, um, I put them like in here so they're a little bit more functional because I was grabbing them, but this might prompt me a little more. So I'll recycle all this. All right, and then in the end, I'm gonna keep this out because I'm getting ready to use it anyways. Um, in the end, these are all I end up keeping and it's just because they're like small things or things I feel like I would like travel with me and make that useful. All right, so usually up here, this is my Etsy workspace. So we're gonna use the last one of this little, um, this started out like massive and I just kept cutting it down as I used more. So it's a little Etsy sticker and we'll put it up here and then we had just gone by all the stuff. Um, I need to like sit down and just have some focus and get some stuff done for Etsy because I just have not had it. This is what you can purchase from my shop. So these are mini Etsy icons and absolutely cute. So we will put a second one there because I just think it's cute happening on both sides. Anyways, I need to sit down and have the focus. I've had a lot of brain fog lately and that's just not, not a beautiful thing to have. I think one thing we can do here because this is gonna be like film, edit, upload. So let's go ahead and put those on because um, I like doing a check off. So there's upload, edit, and as much as I want to redesign these stickers, I'm not going to. Like I want to use my newer stickers, but I'm trying to use these stickers as much as I can. And so that is what we're doing right now. So this is a filming, this is Instagram and YouTube, like what my schedule ends up being. So we are gonna put the actual words on here this, this time. So it'll be Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. So there is YouTube, and then I have one right here that says Instagram. Okay, and then 
right? We had filming lists. So let's use one of these instead of our small cameras. These are like the first stickers I ever made and they were on the Cricut instead of my silhouette and the darn thing, like they look all fuzzy. Do you see them? I love them. I would, I would redesign this and make it, um, make it on my silhouette because they would come out better. But then my darn Cricut would never cut right and it was really, really frustrating. Okay, what else do we have? We have meals, workouts. All right, I like to use my workout icons. This is the big one. I have some that are small also, um, but I think it's really cute to put over here. Okay, let's get that out of the way here. And voila, just like that, the week is already set up. I don't think I am going to fill this all out with you on camera. I might turn it off, do it really quick, and then give you guys a little snippet after the fact. Um, but see how fast this ends up going? So even pulling extra stickers, like, it was so super quick. So, all right, let me fill it out real quick. All right, guys, here it is all filled out. You can see you can add a lot into this. Like, this has my schedule, my to-do list, my filming, and it that includes filming, editing, and uploading. It has my workouts, it has my meal ideas for the week, it has all my work items, and then also down here, it has like my posting, what I am doing for the week. So you guys can see this one page ends up spreading out over these two pages very, very well. All right, if you guys like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Make sure you're following me here and also on Instagram, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!